comic is someone who says funny things. A comedian is someone who says things funny. That makes me a YouTuber. Welcome back to Cheap House, where I did have to peek. I had pretty much the back half of this map spoiled for me because I couldn't figure out where to go. And you know what? That's fine. I will still probably be terrified out of my mind. This is what I was missing. Oh no. A puzzle in my horror map. Now I can look stupid in front of a whole wide range of audiences. Lord, a lot of diaries here. What's your shtick? It looks like he hide the remains of the victims inside this chest. We found out that this chest belongs to his mother who died of breast cancer exactly 15 years after he was born. Doctors say that the cancer started after his birth. Drop items to do pressure plates. Have you killed? Innocent. I... How many innocents have you killed? I, I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming pressure plates open doors? Let's find out. Yep, not that one. Uh, are we just gonna... Nope, not that one. Am I just going to brute force this until I find a solution. I don't know how many innocent people I've killed. That doesn't look like that did anything. Or did it? Oh, let's see here. One, two, three, four. Nope, still four doors. Nothing. Behold! Gameplay. I just do I just keep throwing? Nope. I nope 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 nope. Give me back the rifle. I don't know how many innocent people I've killed. I'm assuming none. Is there none in answer? One. Like, how deranged of a maniac do they think I am? Sure. I... assume I've killed very few people. Four. Okay. Hey, another door. Okay. This is obviously one answer. Hot damn. Oh. Got it. Was that? Whatever, let's just get the hell out of here. Oh, hello! Things have respawned! Gentlemen, please, please! I have no qualms with any of you. You can all leave here alive! Much better. Okay. Boiler room. I, 
I don't like going in... I don't know about you, but I really don't like going in boiler rooms. Why is there lava in the boiler room? Why did the lights go out? Why am I in a hallway? Will anything make sense anytime soon? That was well done. That was well done. Who could have foreseen the monster at the end of the hallway? Oh, the office complex. Neat. That's a face only a mother could love. Neat. Ooh, nice. Hello. I need to place something here. Very good. But what? Oh, strong med heal. Okay. I'll throw one of the regions up here. I at least want to keep... I at least want to keep track of my ammo usage, kind of. Documents. Very good. Oh, this looks just like my office at work. Dude, it must be an office gym. That's pretty good, actually. Wow. Man, no wonder this place fell to pieces. They're all, they're all, they're all juiced up. Uh, am I... Hey. Hey. Still trying to escape, I see. Yeah. I, I wish will. you luck with that. Thank you. But someone is really don't want to let you to escape. Ah. Oh no. Time to juice up. Wait. Do I now get to fight this guy? Is that what happens now? There he is. He looks different now. Was that it? Not in flesh. Experiment. The music's a little loud. Thank you. Now, if I'm to assume correctly, the music is still... Orange wool. I, I think that goes on the altar. Kill you, you son of a bitch. Very good. The doctor's dead. 
And he dropped a chain sword. Automatic bolt cutter. That actually does pretty good damage. Now let's see what the good doctor says. Uh, the police have been looking for my son. I pray that there's no coincidence. My hands are shaking. I can't work anymore. I've abandoned my laboratory. Uh-huh. Was brutally killed. I took the remains of my son and tried to revive him with the help of a secret substance. The dead, burnt body greatly increased in size and came to life. Hired the best CIA to find the killer. I will conduct the experiment. Oh, shit. I'm not innocent. I'm the guy. I'm the guy who killed this guy's kid. I'm the. Oh, God. That's a good twist. I am not the. I am not innocent in any of this. I need to find some redstone torches, I guess. Because uh, that's next, I guess. Um, I am not innocent in any of this. I killed this guy's son. I think that e invincible experiment that's been running around this whole time. I am the reason that is around. That is a fantastic twist. Oh, those look like redstone torches. Look, it's time to tell you who I really am. I am an agent who works for the secret corporation called Corot. I know a lot about you, and I will give you a chance to get out of there, despite everything you have done. Yeah, I'm but a in child return, murderer. You will work for the Corot Corporation without the possibility of refusal. If you agree, then go upstairs. If not, then stay here forever. <sighs> I, I suppose I need to... To repent a little bit for the things I've done. Um, hmm. is it one last jump scare? This music reminds me of Graveyard Keeper. Just an observation. Why am I in a movie theater? Oh. Thanks for playing. I guess I'm done? Or am I just perpetually now trapped in a movie theater. I suppose I'm now trapped in a movie theater serving out my serving out my sentence. Wow. Huh. Well, okay, let's talk about this map here. So, I think the first half of this map was really really strong. Uh, kind of, you'd like, you knew walking in, this is a horror map, and you knew you're being lured in, you know that this character, that your character's being lured in by promises of a house. I love, of a cheap house. I love that premise so much. And then getting, uh, uh kidnapped and trapped by the evil doctor there, brilliant. Then there's the, um, 
And then that first half, just kind of blindly wandering around, trying to figure out what the hell you're doing there. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, the introduction of the unkillable monster, awesome. But then I think the map kind of introducing uh, monsters into the map, I think, was not to this map's benefit. Um, I really like the idea of this experiment just running around and you can't kill it. But then you introduce, like, another threat, these zombies... I assume they were zombies that you can that you can do combat with and you can fight and they suddenly go from being scary to just being the any it's like in amnesia amnesia the dark descent having monsters that you can't kill running around that you need to hide from are way scarier than an enemy that you can observe. Uh, kite away from and can kill with relative ease. So I think having zombies kind of free roam around here or spawn in was this map's detriment. I would have much rather had a scary environment and have the monster appear in like scripted events and then disappear see, and then disappear after a certain period of time. I would rather have something like that where it appears in almost a scripted manner than have uh, enemies that I can do combat with. Uh, but first half of the map, absolutely brilliant before you're really introduced into the monsters. The atmosphere was great. The story premise was great. That last 12 minutes was very confusing where suddenly now it goes from horror map to basically like a action action adventure with in a disturbing environment. I think we could have done with a little less combat. Like, this unkillable monster I killed in, like, two or three hits. Two or three hits. Mind you, it killed me the first time, because I didn't really know 100% what's going on. But, like, two or three hits, monster's dead. Go in, fight the doctor. One hit, I get it's a doctor. One, two hits, he's dead. That really kind of was kind of jarring for me. That being said, I think this map was, was very good. Uh, the LGSC team, very good at what they do. Uh, so for that... I'd say this map is a very good uh, 7 point, uh, seven point five out of out of ten. Very good map. Uh, very happy with. Very happy that this map was recommended to me and that I played it. Um, I can't wait to see what the LGSC team has uh, has up their sleeves next. And uh, I'm yeah, I'm excited for what they have next. Uh, thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. <laughs>